Hello, Rigoberto. How are you? <clears throat> so what happened today? Rigo, tell me what happened today. Oli, how are you? Hi, Edwin. Hey, Loli. How was your day? I, 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 I'm not fine. No, what happened, Oli? Um, <coughs> <laughs> me duele la cabeza. Ahí me están diciendo cómo decir, pero ando con migraña. No, no, it's okay, Oli. Tell me, how, how do you say in English? Um, a hat. Headache, um, I'm bad. A strong, a strong headache. Yes, a strong headache. Um, did you take medicine? Yes, I am. I don't know. Okay, what medicine did you take? Um, uh, I. Uh, I need uh, Oxaforte. I took Oxaforte um, Relaflex. Okay. And the medicine is good or no? It works? It is good. Um, so um, I am have a, a sleeping. Okay. So in this moment, you want to sleep? Yeah, uh, see. It's good. I am After, <laughs> mm -hmm. After the class, boom, go to sleep. Uh, I'm media class, I sleep. No, no, after the class, <laughs> it's correct. After the class, <laughs> yes. Then you go to sleep. Yes, Oli, it's good. Uh -huh. No creo que aguante. No, 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 it's okay, Oli. After the class, no problem. <laughs> you sleep all night. <laughs> Oh, it's okay, Oli. Hey, in the class, I is is I hear in my my song. You hear and your? Food. Yes. Mm. Ah, okay. It's Alejandro. Alejandro. Yes, it's my song. Ah, okay. That's good. I I yes, I speak in English uh, so much. I bet my uh, I bet on on me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's good. All right, Oli, let's go ahead, guys, and we're going to get started. As you know, today is the last day for this week. Tomorrow there are no classes. Remember, in this module is Monday through Thursday, so tomorrow there are no classes. Only the idea for we're going to review a little bit about yesterday. Yesterday, we were talking about family members, and today we're going to continue with family members, okay? So we want to describe a little bit our family member, but more today, we're going to expand also to our friends, okay? So remember the question was, tell me about your, and then the person. So I can say to Marielos, tell me about your, your husband. Or I can tell Miguel, tell me about your daughter or 
uh, to Juan Jose, tell me about your coworker. Today, that is the first activity is reviewing the descriptions, okay? All right, we're gonna have a few moments. The objective, the objective for speaking is you should have eight complete sentences in 30 seconds. You should be able to speak eight complete sentences in 30 seconds. As an example, Marielos is a very beautiful person. She lives in Santa Tecla and she works at uh, the US Embassy. You should have eight sentences in 30 seconds to describe one person. Okay, are we ready? Any questions? No questions. No questions? No. Okay, great. Then we're going to go ahead and practice. We're gonna have five minutes to practice and then we present describing a person.
Okay, are we ready? Yes. Excellent, Maritza. Okay, Maritza, you have 30 seconds to make eight sentences. Ready? Yes, ready. <clears throat> okay, Maritza, describe somebody. I, I don't remember the name of my partner, but she has a brother and his her brother is 30 years old. He lives in San Salvador. He works our work works out in a gym for two hours every day. He visits her his parents on weekends. He gave a gives a present for a, to her to his parents. He is um, okay. married. Five seconds, that's it, five sentences. All right, not too bad, not too bad. It could be better, but okay. Remember, he gave presents to his parents. To his parents. Yes, not her. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. I get confused. I was nervous. No problem. Sorry. Okay, no problem. Thank you so much, man. It's a good job. Only one mistake, five sentences. We need to work faster on the fluency. Who is next? Okay. The next, okay, Miguel Angel. Okay, Miguel, you ready? The timer is zero, 30 seconds, eight sentences. Ready? Ready. Oh. Well, my brother is very worked because her job is in a company of security. And my father lied with me because my mother did uh, three years old. Uh, my, daughter, my daughter has 14 years, she was born in month of March, my wife is the woman more beautiful that I know makes my life happy. My cousin live in Yusulutan, he visit, he visit always in Okay, Christmas. very good, very good. All right, pretty good job. Uh, thank you, thank you so much, Miguel, for, for coming up with the sentences. Miguel, you have a lot of mistakes. Most of the sentences are incorrect. In the chat, you can see how to correct them. Uh, you say a lot of the pronouns incorrectly. Um, you, for his job has 14 years. Remember, that's Spanish. It's not English. In English, it is 14 years old, not only 14 years. Uh, woman, your wife is woman more beautiful is not correct. Your wife is the most beautiful woman change the order and put the correct prepositions, okay? All right, good, okay, take notes and make the sentences correctly. Write them so that we can make sure that you improve, okay? Who is next, who is next? Alex, all right, ready Alex? 30 seconds, you ready? Okay. Go. Okay, my friends is, um... He is a supervisor in the factory. Uh, he, uh, he is married uh, with your, uh, he has two little boys. Um, uh, he studied with me in, in, in the last time and in, um, also study English. Um, okay, in, in that's the, it. Thank you, Alex. Very good. The sentences are correct. The correct sentences, but the fluency, Alex, we have to go. Only four sentences. It's a long time. To sound natural, you have to go faster. You have to practice going faster. But okay, the correct teacher. order. Good job. Good job, Alex. All right. Who's next? Me? Go, Marcela. 30 seconds. Okay. Describe someone. Ready? Okay. Ready. Go. Okay, I described Oli. Oli is 50 years old and she stays at home. She is married for six years and her husband plays the guitar. They have they have three sons and their youngest son is 21. So that's it. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, Marcela. You need to have more vocabulary. You stop speaking at 24 seconds. Imagine you go to a job interview and they say, tell me about yourself. You go to a person, they say, describe your job. You need to have more vocabulary and continue speaking. 
Don't stop okay. speaking. You got to keep going. All right. You ready, Marcel? Continue, continue. 30 seconds. Go, Marcel, continue. Okay. So, uh, can. <laughs> okay, Marcel, thank you. There you go. Don't worry, Marcel. That's the idea. You need to think of vocabulary, Marcel. Vocabulary for descriptions, adjectives, professions, uh, locations, physical descriptions, personality. All right, but good job, Marcel. But we got to get more vocabulary. Who's next? Hi. Uh, my okay, partner Oli, is... you ready? Yeah, okay, yes. 30 seconds. All right, Oli, describe someone. Okay. Go. Okay. My partner is Marcela. Marcela is studying um, in the university and the family and the living in the family and the mother and the woman he is um i know work um uh, uh, that uh, that's it <laughs> okay all right only the same thing only only you have a lot of mistakes in grammar vocabulary and descriptions only you okay. need to organize the grammar. In the chat, you can see some of the mistakes that you have for your grammar. Uh, is the living? No, my partner or the person lives because Live. it's continuing. Lives, okay. no, is the living. And the pronouns, you confuse. Remember, I is you and the other person. So I no work, no, she. She, she. doesn't work. He doesn't work, okay? Okay. Okay, no problem, Oli. Remember, focus, write it down. Oli, that's why no more husband, Oli. No husband. You have to practice. No, no husband. Excellent. No, not practice here today. It. Excellent. <laughs> Only practice you. All right, Oli. Okay. Good job, Oli. I know. Continue practicing. Don't worry, Oli. Yes, thank at, you. At nine o'clock, you go to sleep. Don't worry. One more. 45 minutes, you go to sleep, <laughs> Oli. Relax. No problem. Okay. Okay, who's Thank next? You. Who's next? Uh huh. Marielos. Me, teacher. Okay, Marielos. You ready? 30 seconds. Okay. Ready? Um, okay, Go. yeah. Uh, Juan Jose is uh, married. His, his wife works in a humanity uh, foundation who, who built, uh, who built, um, I don't know, uh, houses for the pearls and um, he has um, three daughters. Uh, the oldest daughter is 35 years old. Okay, has thank you very much, Marielos. Okay, Marielos, okay. don't worry. <laughs> it's okay. We got to go faster, Marielos. We got 30 seconds, as you can see. Marielos, the idea is the fluency, only one mistake. Remember, Marielos, who is for people? So who is no who builds is uh, uh, she works for the company which builds which or that okay. builds. Okay, thank you. Right. You're welcome. No, thank you, Mar thank you, Marielos, for practicing the fluency. All right, who is next? I Me, think teacher. Mayra, right? Mayra. All right, Mayra. We have 30 seconds. Okay. You ready? My Mayra? partner. Yes, oh. I'm ready. My partner and I took about Martita. Martita uh, is her sister. And she's the best beautiful woman. And then we took about above my brother and my brother lives in San Salvador. And he does many people for a living, for example, cooking and painting. So, and then uh, the time's over. Nope, uh, now it's okay. over. Uh, and then... that, now it's over. Ah, you have one more sentence, one more sentence. Not bad, not bad. Only you have to be careful with the vocabulary. For example, you says you said does many, many people. Okay, so you say my brother does many people for a living, but not many uh, people. No, my brother does many things. Okay, my bad. Exactly. You have to be careful, Marielos. Porque lo que me dijiste fue que mi hermano coge muchas personas para, para vivir, para sobrevivir. Ah, imagine. Ajá, uh -huh, it's okay. Yo soy, tu, yo soy aquí tu, 
te, tu teacher y yo te entiendo, pero en una conversación yo pensaría, uy, you gotta be careful, María, el vocabulary, el vocabulary. Ajá. Ok, pero okay. no, 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 no. prefiero que hagan el error aquí y no en una situación de negocio, una situación donde de verdad va, eso va a ser algo. And Marielos, you have to be careful with your final sounds. The final sounds, no me estás pronunciando la E, D al final de las palabras. Ok, tenés que decir la palabra no en presente, sino que en el pasado, como decís la cosa en el pasado. So, continue working on the E, D, worked, talked, and so on. Ok. Uh, ok, thank you. Excellent, thank you, Marielos. All right, I think we have one Maida. more, right? We Maida. have Juan Jose or, or Katia. Okay, Juan Jose, you ready? 30 yeah, seconds. My, my co-worker is Marielos. Um, I asked about her family. Uh, he, he has um, six uh, sons. Uh, four are male and two are female. Um, the oldest is 27 years old. He is graduated from engineer system. University, uh, National, uh, National University in El Salvador. Um, that's all. I okay, all right. Ask. Good, 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 good. We got 30 seconds. Don't worry, right there. You can see we got 30 seconds on the clock. Very good. It's good idea, Juan Jose, but you are speaking English and Spanish. He, she has six sons, that's seis hijos, four, four boys and three girls. Six sons, son seis says varones that's in english remember okay in english is how do we say los hijos hijos y hijas in english how do we say it children hey, 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 you know one you know you know the vocabulary only you need to practice okay katya you are the last you ready katya okay katya 30 seconds eight sentences ready you need teacher by i explain you my problem I... No, 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 no in the group. It's in this moment, in here, in the class. No in the group. Um, and I, I had to talk about... Anybody, your mom, your father, your brother, anybody you like. Um, okay. Okay, you ready? Um, okay. okay, go. Okay. Um, I live with my parents and my sister. And my sister have a song. And my father is friendly and intelligent. My mother too. Um, I work in a university in the afternoon and I work too in a special education school. Um, I had to travel every day to, to San, from Santa Ana to Metapan. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. That is it, Katia, you have 31 seconds. Good. Okay, Katya, you need to learn, you need to develop describing other people. You only talk about yourself and you need to practice the third person. You Because need to practice making with S, for I example. I didn't know how, how, how. No, 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 it's okay. For example, you see my sister, no, my sister half. What is the correct, Miguel? Ah, you know, you know, Katya, correct, correct. Excellent, uh-huh. So that is the idea, okay? Don't worry. This, This is the objective for advance. This is the idea for advance, to speak fluently. Fluently is not fast, but fluently is fast without mistakes. Fast without mistakes. This is the important, this is the idea, all right? Any questions? Alex, I don't remember Alex pass. Alex, you didn't pass? Yes, I pass. Yes? Yes. I okay, pass. Alex. Ah, that's right. That's right. Okay. Very good. Okay. So now what are we going to do is we are going to talk about how your family has changed. Remember in this unit, we looked at the expressions for how the family changed. Marcela, what was one expression for people and changes? How do they change? Um, for example, uh, I used to. Excellent, excellent. Used to is one example, good. Uh, Maritza, what is another expression for changes? 
Oi, for changes. Eh, I don't know. I I like to to go to the movies. I I I and now I like to go to the park. Maybe. Okay. No, Maritza. No, it's it's good idea. It's good idea. It's good example. I like to go to the movies. Is in present. Remember, we have to find the way to change it. So when you use the verb in present, is the meaning is now. We have a couple expressions. Is like used to, used to, or now we use with more or er. Okay. Uh, more. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. These are the comparatives. So now we are describing your family, your friends, your partners. In this moment, we're going to make the groups. And now we're going to say the difference, the changes, the changes for your partner it is more interesting, is uh, your partner now is slower or your family member is, is nicer, is meaner. Is, you are going to describe, for example, my family before, I didn't, I didn't used to talk with my cousins. And now we talk in the WhatsApp group, for example. Okay. Okay. Any questions? No? Okay, Katia, how do you say solía? Solía trabajar, solía ir. How do you say solía, Katia? Uh, used to. Excellent. This is the expression that Marcela said, used to. That's right. Okay. That's the idea, used to or more or ER. Okay. Are we ready? Five minutes, quickly, quickly. Remember, when you are speaking, no, eh, no, no, no. Eight sentences, eight sentences in 30 seconds. Let's go. <clears throat>
Okay. Katya, did you have problems or it's okay this time with Alex? Uh, with Marielos. Oh, with Marielos. Yeah, but it's okay. It's no time. problems. No, no problems. Thank you. Ah, okay, excellent. Yes, sir. Okay, yes. Uh, I have a question. Yes, Marcela. Uh, there is there a, a form to use the used to in negative? Yes, it didn't. I'm going to give you an example in the chat. If you see in the negative form is I didn't and the used to no D, no D because it's not in the past. Use is in the present because you have the auxiliary didn't. Okay, thank you. You're welcome, Marcel. Okay, are we ready? Teacher. Yes. I have a question. Uh, 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 an example, my favorite sport used to basketball, but... Used to be, used to be basketball. Used to be, used to be. excellent, excellent. Used to be basketball, but right now uh, I like playing soccer. Is good example. It's good example. It's good example. Okay. Only the only the pronunciation, Miguel. Okay. My favorite. 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 Mm -hmm. And uh, it used to be basketball. Correct. Okay. And now it's playing soccer. But right now is I like playing soccer. No play. No. No, no es playa. No play. Play. Play, play. play. Okay. Exactly. Play soccer. Okay. Very good. Excellent, Thank Miguel. You, Miguel, you. select one person. Oh, uh, Katia. Katia. Okay, Katia, give us. Nothing. About uh, Mariel? Okay. About Mariel also. Remember, used to. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, Marielos used to um, exercise. She used to get uh, together um, a kid a Krishna with her family. And Marielos used to work, used to work in San Salvador. And she used to. Okay, very uh, good, Katya. Around the uh, neighbor. Very good, Katya. The sentence is correct. Grammatically is correct. And is good vocabulary, Katya. What we need is this more details, more information, because on the sentence is very, very small. It's like intermediate, okay? So Marielo used to work in San Salvador. It's good, it's not bad, but Marielo used to work in San Salvador because, or her job was, but you need more description, okay? Good job. Katya, select the next person. Okay. Um... Marcela? Okay. Marcela, you ready? Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. Um Mayra's family. Mayra's family didn't used to talk about their problems, but now they share about it. Also uh, they didn't used to spend time together for different reasons, but now uh, they spend time for special days or holidays. Good, all right. Good job, good job, Marcin. Uh, nice, good sentences, long descriptions, only we need to work the fluency. Okay. okay. Good, good job, Marcel. Marcel, select the next person. Um, Alex. Okay. Alex, you ready? Okay. Okay. Um, Go. Okay. Milton used to work in the fabric textile and they provide for fabrics for, for soap or mm, 
styles in my plan in very in very things. Um, you uh, Milton used to um, know uh, much, very much uh, about the. Okay. Thank uh, you very much. We got thirty seconds. Very good. Good idea. Only we have to be careful with the pronouns. It's not my factory, right? It's, it's, not... our, it's okay, our factory. <laughs> okay, our, exactly, uh-huh. And only the pronunciation. Repeat, things. Thing. Correct. That is the correct. Good idea, Alex. Good job. Only two Thanks. mistakes, that's good. Alex, who's next? Um... Juan Jose, Juan Jose, creo que se llama. Juan Jose, okay, Juan Jose. You ready, Juan Jose? No, I'm ready, but I'm going to try. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, you can do it. You can do it. I, um, my co worker was uh, Miguel and began to, to speak about a just two. Uh, for example, her, her daughter. A kind of music. I don't remember what kind of music, but in this moment, she uh, listened Christian music. Um, said me that uh, her her daughter uh, like play volleyball, and casually uh, my daughter play volleyball too. <laughs> that is all. Is who was your partner, Juan Jose? Excuse me, uh, uh, Miguel Angel. Miguel Angel is a man or a woman? It's a um, it's a man. What do we use to describe his, his men? Daughter. His daughter. Ah, uh huh. Uh huh. You got to be careful. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you. Thank you. Good. No, no. Good job. Good job. Only the mistake, the pronoun. Good job. All right. Work more on the fluency so we can get the better sentences completely. Okay. Are we ready? One more. One more. In my case, no more. Go ahead, Juan. Select one person. It's okay. Oh, okay. Okay, but um, well, um, Rigoberto, I, I, I don't know. Rigoberto, excellent. Rigoberto, very quiet in the house. Shh, shh, no, no, no. Rigo wants to participate. Rigo wants to participate. All right, Rigo, you ready? Okay. Rigo? What happened with Rigo? Okay. So, Rigo, maybe not. Okay. Let's go with Mayra. Mayra, you ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, Mayra. It's your opportunity to improve. Okay, my family. There are six people in my family. Before the pandemic, they didn't spend time to head together. They didn't talk about many important things. And my family in the pandemic used to spend a lot of time together and they used to drink coffee every day, every day for two or three months. And after that, my family Spend okay, a lot of time good, together, like special days. <laughs> okay. Excellent, Mayra. Very good. Only the vocabulary, Mayra. My family used to drink coffee two or three. Okay. Two or three. Okay. No moments. What other word can we use? Marielos, how do we say veces? Because my, Mayra wanted to say dos o tres veces al día. How do we say two or three? Times. Correct. Oh. Two or three times a day. Two or three times. Correct. No okay. two or three moments. Okay. Good job. Very nice. Everything else is good. Mayra, did you write down this information? Uh, no, but I oh, no, no. have it's been okay. practicing. That's good. That's the idea. The idea is not to write because when you are speaking, when you are with the other person, no, ah, ah, one moment, one moment. Yeah, ya, voy a escribir. Ya, 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 ya. No, 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 you have to begin speaking and begin speaking. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. I have been practicing silence. Ah, that's excellent. That's excellent. Okay. All right, guys. We're good. Any questions then? Teacher is correct uh, when I am. I say uh, an example. My shoes used to be nice when I am I am younger, but I changed changed uh, the mark because the problem with illicit groups. No, Miguel. Uh, Joe, it, it's a lot of words and a lot of grammar not correct. I can okay. help you. Okay. Okay. First, that good idea is good that you are trying, but you're using words from Spanish to English and the words don't exist. For example, okay. marks is, doesn't exist. Marks in English, I think you want to, the word is las marcas, right? You want to say la, las marcas? Okay. So in English, these are brands. Mm -hmm. Brands. Ah, yes. Okay. That's why in social media, in business, is brand name. Mm -hmm. brand, brand name. Brand name. Uh huh. Okay. Or in general, brands. Brands. Okay. Now, let me help you, Miguel. One more time. Begin the sentence, and I write in the chat the correct way. Okay. In the chat. No, no. You tell oh. me. Go ahead. You speak, okay. and I help you. Okay. My shoes. My shoes used to be a brand name brand name Nike when I am younger but I changed the brand brand name because uh, the problems with illicit growth okay but the problem what Elicited growth, uh, pandillas. Ah, okay. 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 So let me help you. I'm going to put in the chat, in the chat. My shoes, okay. the correct way is my shoes used to be brand name. This is complete. Oh, used, my or, shoes used to be brand name. Or no brand name. Or my shoes used to be Nike. Only one, not the two. My shoes used to be Nike or my shoes used to be brand name when I was oh. younger. But I changed brands, not but the problem. I changed brands because of the gangs. I changed brands because okay. you can see in the chat you can see in the okay chat. thanks teacher you're welcome you're welcome okay any other questions before we continue uh, me teacher I have a question mm -hmm. uh, after used to uh, we can use the verb with ing or uh, only in infinity forms after which one Maida? After used to. Ah, only uh, with infinitive. Only infinitive. Yes. Okay. Thank you, so teacher. It's not correct. I used to uh, being, I used to watching. No, I used to watch. I used to see. I, uh -huh. um, okay. Okay, great. In this moment, we want to practice our fluency and our vocabulary. I want you to ask follow-up questions. Do you remember what are follow-up questions? In the first day of class, we practiced follow-up questions. Do you remember? No. So, so, no remember? No, I don't remember. Okay, no problem, Maritza. The follow-up questions is when the partner begin the conversation, I ask more questions. What, where, when, why? To follow up, to continue the conversation. As an example with Maritza. Maritza is my partner. Maritza, what are you going to do this weekend? Hey, I'm going to San Miguel because my nephew is, is um, He's going to celebrate his birthday. Now, my follow-up question is two. 
I continue the conversation with Maritza. Maritza, what is your nephew's name? How old is your nephew? Because for Maritza's conversation, I, I need more information, the name and the birthday. I need to know the age. So I practice the questions. Maritza, what is the name of your nephew? His name is uh, Luis. 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 And how, how old is Luis? He's, 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 a, he's, a, he's a little boy. He's uh, eight years old. Oh, he's, and you see, the idea is continue the conversation. No, it's no interview. No, do you like pizza? Yes, I do. Uh, are you in some again? Yes, I am. No, 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 no. It's, it's natural conversation. You ready? Yes. Mm, a mí no me suena como que ya estamos seguros. Me suena como que, mm, teacher, no lo quiero hacer. No, I, I, yes, are we ready? Yes, or, yes. 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 Ah, okay, okay. Let's go, then we can do this. Let's try. Yes. The mistakes are part of the process. It's normal, the mistakes. If you make mistakes, it's good because you are learning from the mistakes. Okay? Okay. We have 10 minutes, five minutes, five minutes. Ask, but remember, important practice making questions. What, where, when, how, how much, how often, Free that important, ask the questions.
Okay, guys. Great job. Remember, the objective, advanced practice, speaking, speaking, speaking different topics, feel comfortable, correct the mistakes. This is the idea. No, no, a lot of grammar. No, a lot of speaking, a little grammar, a lot of speaking. Okay. So have a good weekend. Monday, we practice. Monday, we practice past tense. We practice what you did. Today, we practice future. Monday, we practice past. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. A, a ver si wow. se pueden los verbos. Ahí les voy a preguntar. Past tense. 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 Past participle. Les voy a tener. Ya, voy a, ya tengo oh. la lista. Ya la estoy preparando. Vamos a ver. Les voy a, a ver cómo estamos. Ok. Practice. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. Thank you. See you Monday. Monday. See you Monday. Okay. Bye, Bye coach. Good night.